Hello my dear Aquarius, welcome to a new reading, I'm so happy to see you here. If you are new, welcome my dear soul, please hit that subscribe button, join me for future readings, I'm here every day for you. And if you are an old friend, welcome back, thank you for taking the time to be here with me. Let's find out my dear soul, what is in the cards for you? What is it that you need to know right now? This is a timeless general reading, so please take only what resonates with your life, with your situation. So, Aquarius, what's happening with you? Oh, okay, okay, changes, changes. Okay, looking towards, oh my goodness, uh, it's like a revolution in your life right now. You just don't want to put up with someone or something here. Okay, so let me tell you. King of Swords here. Hmm. Now, looking back to the recent past here, you made some choices, some decisions that weren't quite good, right? Did not bring you what you thought they did. They put you. They they put you in the size. <laughs> they put you in the size. But there is a good side of uh, this card. It's the Ten of Swords and it's the positive side of the card. Telling you, my dear soul, that the ice is melting. The ice is melting. And this beautiful angel here is telling you to wake up. To um, This is the time when you... Um, you let go, you shed the old and you embrace the new. This is your rebirth, my dear soul. You are giving up on something. You just say no to someone or something here and you are just starting all over again, which is good. Some people never realize. Some people never wake up, you know. They never take this uh, call. So, in regards of the past choices or plans, ideas that you had, you weren't that that beneficial for you. You did what uh, someone else told you or you got yourself into, into a situation where you thought you can you can get something fast and easy. You know? You thought so, but wasn't yeah, wasn't quite what you were meant to do. So your success, whatever you wanted to to get um, in your life, you thought maybe by tricking others or not being honest with other people, trying small tricks will get you there where you want. But the reality was hitting you, right? So... What I get for you here right now is that if you thought you can get something without too much effort, you were wrong. This is what your cards are showing me. That some of you, you thought you can win very fast a battle here and did not work out for you. And that's all right. That's a lesson. At least you try. At least you know that... Things are not this way, that you should be more uh, to work harder, to learn more. You understand that it, some things you just have to put your hands on it, you know, and make it work. It's not like you just do the minimum and expect the maximum results, you know. So you have the Ten of Swords here, which is a good card. The ice is melting. The difficult time is passing and now you need to work right now you need to juggle look at this two of pentacles this guy over here is juggling with two coins two jobs two can be um, the money that you have the time that you have um, it's 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 not easy but it's not also impossible so to to put yourself back together, um, it's necessary to um, look at this, the hangman, to have a different perspective, to change your ways, because the way you did it in the past did not brought you the uh, results that you wanted. So now just try to see, seek 
different solutions, right? So um, the way you thought you will make money, uh, it isn't that easy. Um, if it's about money, uh, I just got in my hand here. Uh, some of you, because we have the Queen of Pentacles here, and the Queen of Pentacles is um, the one that uh, she's a practical uh, person. She's someone that you know takes the lead, goes to work, creates her own happiness. So this is something that some of you need to learn that nobody can do better than you the things that you want right so create your own happiness and yes that requires to uh, maybe collaborate with certain people um, work with them learn from them uh, don't just stay on a side and expect like others to do things that you only you can do for yourself so in this next chapter of your life, Aquarius, you are being called to change your ways. You are being called to um, learn your lessons from everything that happened to you until this point. And make sure you don't repeat this, the history. The history has to stay there in the past. So prepare yourself better. Eight of Wands is a card of... of of news coming in maybe you need to travel maybe you 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 need to really um, get out of the comfort zone whatever that means for you but also this specific eight of wands shows us um, a woman here uh, cutting some flowers and just preparing something you know she's she's getting ready for something so this is your moment where you need to you know to prepare yourself for a new journey uh, where you need to gather everything that you've got right and start this new journey do things differently um, another thing here is that some of you, you may decide to move in a new city, in a new place. We have the village here showing that this, this girl, she's going somewhere. She's traveling towards a new place. So for some of you, uh, this means that um, the biggest change here is not only in the way you think and you deal with your life, but also you may... Uh, go through a big change like moving out from someplace, you know, changing your um, location um, because you are just not in the right place. You tried, it's just not for you. Queen of Pentacles, Three of Cups and Knight of Wands. This is a beautiful energy showing that someone here realizes that, wait a minute, I thought I can go the easy way. It's just not my thing. Looks like I really have to to change my ways. Uh, maybe I need to look somewhere else uh, for like-minded people. Not everyone has my vision. So let me see where I did not look, what I did not uh, pay, on what I did not pay attention to. So you will connect with people that will get you with who you will be able to work easily and um, to accomplish all the things that you want. But the most important here, my dear Aquarius, is about you being active. You cannot be lazy. You cannot uh, sit and wait like things to happen for you. You must uh, be active. You need, yes, to work harder than ever we have the two of pentacles here so juggling with multiple things but you will uh, accomplish more this way than if you try you know the easy way it's just not for you my dear soul and that's all right that's all right this shows that you are made for so much more you can do so much more hold the highest vision for your life you now possess the ability to move past any hurdles Exactly. You know, some of you, uh, you thought you need other people to do things for you. You thought you are not able to do certain things. 
Now is your wake up call. You are much capable than you think you are. You just have to believe in yourself and you have to let go of all these kind of things that hold you back and made you uh, uh, make some bad decisions in the past here. Now is the time when you are in control and you go for what you want and you must believe in yourself. And if there is something that um, if you don't, feel that confident ask yourself why what you don't know what you should know go learn um, improve your skills and as you take action as you change your ways um, as you do new things you will see that it will be provided to you everything that you need to be successful to get there where you want so my dear soul this is what I get for you right in this moment. Thank you so much for being here with me. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't done it yet. I can't wait to see you next time. Love and light.